Jammers, this is Snowy Claw from the Animal Gem Spirit here on one of my many storage accounts. And here we are in the Paradise Party. I'm here today to show you the journey book guide for the Paradise Party. This is one of the most challenging journey book pages because there's just so many birds and it's so big. This is bigger than most lands. It's kind of wacky. So, anyway, here are the animals and let's get started. I should mention, here is the Paradise Shop, which is the other attraction for this for this party. And plenty of neat items. We might be adding more seeing all the spaces here. Um, so let's see if we can find some birds. <laughs> let's see. So there should be a bird around here, and he'll come out once in a while. But the key to this party is knowing where to look and being really patient because it gets really frustrating waiting for all these birds. Here's this guy. He comes out, shakes his tail feathers, and you have to act fast because he's pretty tricky to catch. Cornell Lab Ornithology. That's, that's a really neat picture. Dancing like ballerinas. Ballerinas are really strong if you didn't already know. Ballet is a really hard sport. You, I mean, you might not think about it, but it takes a lot of strength to be able to dance well. There's this guy. The Red Bird of Paradise. The most colorful and unique birds in the world. Neat! Let's see what else we can find. What a huge forest this is. I love that little pond there. Is he coming out yet? Nope. We'll come back for you, mister. Or misses. <laughs> Often the male have the males of the species have more colorful feathers than the females, mainly because the males need to impress the females, and the females need to be able to blend in with their surroundings so that the babies that they're raising are safe. Here's the paradise rifle bird. Distinguish themselves while dancing. That's a pretty good way to get girls to look your way, I guess. <laughs> so here's, here are these mysterious ruins. No one really knows where they're from or how they got here, but just another mystery, I guess. This looks like an old well, even. I wonder if there is some sort of lost gymnasium civilization. Let's see, there's a bird that comes up right here that you have to watch out for. But as with all the birds, pretty tricky to catch. I guess we'll wait here a little bit. We'll come back. Let's see. Oh, there he is, of course, just when I leave. There he goes. He rocks back and forth. Twelve long, wiry feathers that grow from its body. See that? Those are some, that's some wacky tail feathers. Let's see. Get up in this direction. Isn't this pretty? Well, there's a bird that comes by and he perches on this cart. We can wait a, little, a couple seconds, see if he comes out. Oh, there he is. Just click on him. The Blue Bird of Paradise. I wonder why he has that name. Impress them by hanging upside down off a branch. Some tricky gymnastics moves there. Let's see. Oh, there's this guy. Very impressive. He ducks down in the bushes. He ducks down in the tree branches, so you can't see him. The Greater Bird of Paradise. 45 different species of Bird of Paradise. Oh my gosh. Very nice feathers there. Let's see, what else can we find? It's in a little body of water. There's another of those type of birds that hides down here at the very bottom of the party. Let's see, there's two birds that hide here and here. Let's see if either of them come out. <laughs> 
the Wilsons should be around here somewhere. And then the Victoria Rifle Bird. Victoria's Rifle Bird should be coming out sometime soon. It's just, this party is just about patience. It's the only way to find these birds. That's true for all wildlife, though. You have to be really patient when trying to find... You can't make too much noise. And you just have to be respectful towards this wildlife. There he is! Victoria's Rifle Bird. Papua New Guinea in Northern Australia and a few, and a few surrounding islands. Oh, there's Wilson's! Wilson's Bird of Paradise. Oh, don't go away. Four courting, many male Wilson's Bird of Paradise around areas of the... So, see how fast he left? You have to be really quick when clicking these guys, because they skedaddles. You never see him again. Okay, they come back, but look, there's the lesser bird of paradise, just a little bit smaller than the other one. <laughs> Let's see, what else do we have? Let's go see if we can find that little guy on the branch up there. There's the guy we saw earlier. I'm getting disoriented as to how big this party is. So back near the shop, we need to find King, the King Bird of Paradise. Although he's a bit smaller than his name suggests. And then we'll have to find the King of Saxony Bird of Paradise. If this guy doesn't come out... <sighs> Darn. Let's go see if we can find this, this other one. There he is! King of Saxon. Look at the look at those wacky feathers on his head. Whoa! Extremely long feather plumes that grow from their heads. You can almost imagine them as antennae. See? Boop, boop. <laughs> Let's go see if King Bird of Paris is back. Ah, come on, my little guy. Come out, come out! There he is! Come back. There! Look how those wings spin. It's so neat. I think we're done. No? No, boys, I love some more. Okay. What else do we need? I believe we need the magnificent rifle bird. And we found him! What luck. Look at that blue head and they swish it side to side really fast. Really, really fast. But. As you can see, they say that. <laughs> PBS has a really good video about Birds of Paradise that you, that you guys should check out. It's called Birds of the Gods. And here's the Paradise Throne. Now, it looks kind of bland, but if you put it in your den and you click the tail, it'll fan out like a bird of paradise. It's really neat. So anyway, I hope this was helpful. And... Be sure to stop by the Animal Jam Spirit if you have any questions or if you want to find out some codes or new items and such. And as always, happy jamming!